We're talking about the different criteria for segmentation, and one of the things I said is substantial. What that means is there has to be enough people in the segment to make it worthwhile. And I'm trying to relate it to something that you'd all be familiar with. So how many people in the class here know what OtterBox is? Most of you do, right? Okay. How many people know somebody that put an OtterBox as a safety cover on their phone? Okay, quite a few of you. Now, if you go to the OtterBox website, you can see by brand of phone, you can click on Samsung Galaxy, you can click on the Apple iPhone, you can click on Blackberry and so on, and then within that subdirectory, it'll show you different phones. So it'll say the iPhone 4, iPhone 4S, iPhone 5, iPhone 6, I think they even have the 6 Plus in there in terms of OtterBox offerings. You know what you can't find? You can't find a Google Nexus 4. That's one of the reasons why it's very disappointed and recently switched to the Samsung Rugby LTE. But that's an example of not enough people in the segment. So somebody at head office of OtterBox decided there's not enough people carrying a Google Nexus 4 for us to make that as an OtterBox case to satisfy that particular category. Clothing companies do this as well. They think of the different sizes for blue jeans. So 32 waist, 32 leg. No problem, right? 34 waist, 32 leg. 36 waist, 32 leg. 38 waist, that's a big fat guy with short legs, right? So the chances of you being able to go to the store and finding a 40 waist and 30 legs is very small because there's not too many people in that segment. So that's what it means when you talk about is the segment substantial, meaning are there enough people that have that interest for it to make it worthwhile for the company to offer that product. The same thing with fast food restaurants. You got cheeseburger. You got bacon cheeseburger. You got double bacon cheeseburger. Now, when you look at some of the other offerings, like the chicken burger and the fish burger, they're smaller. There's no fish with bacon on it because not enough people ask for that. Chicken with bacon? Yeah, Wendy's has some, but they don't have a double chicken bacon because there's not enough people that ask for it. So if somebody at head office is trying to figure out how many people will ask for the burger with this combination. Single burger with bacon? Sure. Double burger with bacon? Sure. Maybe even the triple. So that's another example of thinking about is this segment substantial? Are there enough people that would want that?